All right, guys, I uh, hope you can hear me over the, uh, we've got a washer and a dryer going on to the side of this Porsche here, but I'm gonna show you this uh, charger, which I can highly recommend. Um, and I'll pop the link dis uh, in the description below this video. It's a C-Tech charger that I've been using on this old Porsche. Now, stupidly, I left this old Porsche um, without any charger on it for a good few weeks, and the battery died on it, which is uh, quite common on these things. Uh, so I've been using this charger here, which is a Halfords charger, which proved to be pretty ineffective. Well, 100% ineffective, actually. I'd had this hooked up to the battery for about four days. Nothing happened. It just didn't charge at all. Uh, so I switched to one of these C-Tech chargers. And within 24 hours, um, probably about 12 hours, we got stages one, two and three, which means it's sort of like it's on its charge. And then within 24 hours, we hit the seven, which means you can see it's like a green light. And it means that the car is now, or the battery, should I say, is fully charged. Uh, so like I say, I'll pop the link to this in the description. It's a fantastic bit of kit, C-Tech MX5 5.0. Uh, what I'll do is I'm just gonna unlock it. Uh, and then I'm gonna show you where it's hooked up to underneath with a certain knack. So this is where the battery is in this vehicle. Um, you see we've got it hooked up. Incidentally, when I bought this, it looks like there was a, another like charger kit installed, which is this one here, which says Optimate. But when I bought it, they never gave me um, the bit that connects into there. So the, the plug section, if you like, or the actual charging bit. So I need to remove this black cabling here and I'm just gonna use this C-Tech charger um, as and when I need to, but hopefully I won't need to use it for too much longer. Uh, but when it's when the car's gonna be stored for long periods, I will just obviously make sure that this is always available to be hooked up. So that's the C-Tech charger there. As I say, I'd highly recommend it. I'll pop the link to it in the description below this video. Um, this car's like full of fluff. I need to put it. I've got a cover right there as well, so I need to put that on. Um, but yeah, so it's a it's a good to it's a good uh, easy to use. And as you can see, we've just got one end of it going into the car, and the other end of it going into a plug here. So that's just basically how it works, and it's dead simple. So 24 hours. Um, I haven't put it on. There's other settings you can do as well. Like you can do it for a bike. You can do uh, an AGM battery, which is like the 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 vehicles which have stop start uh, or you can do a, a recondition of the battery so i might do that after i've charged it uh, or might try that next time if if i if i'm stupid enough to gain to let the same thing happen but c-tech charger on this old red 1988 porsche uh, has been really really good uh, link in the description thanks for watching